to use what you what you learn from a book in the classroom and apply it to an actual laboratory setting, it, it challenges you in a very different kind of way. Web-spinning insects are uh, in an order of insects called Embioptera. In this particular order, um, Embioptera, all of the individuals spin silk. Not only are we studying the evolution of species, but their behavior, and we're trying to see how that's diversified. I'm a plant evolutionary biologist, and my interests are in um, studying the genetic basis for adaptations in plants. Undergraduates have taken the needles out and extracted the DNA from the needles, and then they've um, used high technology genome sequencing um, to come up with over 100,000 base pairs of DNA from, from one of these Torrey Pine seedlings. I see students, their eyes just light up when instead of doing the cookbook labs that are often taught through high school or maybe at other institutions, that at Santa Clara they actually get the opportunity to take that information directly into a personal experience. This is real science being done by Santa Clara undergraduates. It's just a really nice to be able to have a, just the variety of classes and coursework that you have here. Everybody is different, but for me this has definitely been I think the best school that I could have chosen. Flip over. I've gotten so much personal face time with professors. Like, they know my name, they know so much about me, more than you could do at any school of a bigger size. It's a very close community here. And if you like that, that um, is, I think, the, the best feature of Santa Clara because that extends not only to your social life, making good friends, uh, but it also extends into your academic life. Having these opportunities, research opportunities, working on campus, being in small classes has just been just more than I could have even imagined.